Ladies and gentlemen, what is up? It's your friend Tim, aka General 8 Bit, coming at you with another episode of Don't Starve Arena Giants here on 8 Bit Plays. Last episode, we got to work on killing things. Um, that was a much enjoyed episode from what I saw. Um, at the time of me recording this, literally, literally as I started recording this, we hit 100 subscribers. So, yay, that's fun. You guys are probably going to see this before the 100, 100 subscriber special. Uh, so leave in the comment section below what you guys think I should be doing for the 100 subscriber special. Um, I mean, I don't want to get all too touchy feely in this in this episode of Don't Starve, but essentially, um, it is quite surprising that we hit this 100 subscriber mark. Mainly because of the fact that I really did not expect people to to watch these videos that's such a stereotypical cliche thing to say but it's very much true i did not expect to see people actually enjoy the game of don't starve usually um when i see people who play don't starve it's people who are very much known for like doing a lot of indie games so it's pretty surprising to see people actually enjoy uh don't starve so i mean that's awesome to see that this this game that I love so much is getting some love. Also, because of the fact that we we're doing other series. Also, it's not just the Don't Starve series. It's literally just me doing series such as like Transistor, soon to be Bastion, spoilers, um, other things like that. I mean, like a lot of stuff is coming to the channel. I'm really really excited to be showing you guys off for a hundred for a hundred more subscribers. So I mean, stick around. It'll be fun. I hope. Uh, you guys will enjoy every minute of it. Hopefully, I can get myself some more kills. What I'm going to be doing right now is I'm going to try to get myself... What was that? Did you hear that? Did you guys hear that? I'm about to get attacked by dogs? Yes, I am. Well, well, well. My, my, my. Interesting. I'm going to run over here. Never mind, then. Let's run up north. Um, let's see if we can defend ourselves. Oh, okay. We're on the map. Oh, right there. Okay, so there are a few vault goats left, which is good. Um, I need to take care of these dogs first, I guess. I feel like the dogs are becoming a more frequent thing in this Let's Play. Um, it do it didn't seem like we were getting attacked too much like early on into the days, but apparently we're getting attacked a lot now, which is really freaking annoying if I'm to be completely honest with you. Also, though, God, can I take you? Oh, God. Jeez. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, they're coming at all sides. They're coming from all sides of the world. I want to pick that up, kind of, also. Okay, let's see if we can pick ourselves up some stuff here. Where in the world are these beefaloes right now? Jeez, my sanity is falling like crazy. This sucks a lot. Come on, attack these guys. Look at this massive just area. Oh god, oh god, oh it's a freaking slaughter. Okay, yeah, that's that. Let's head home. I'm sorry, Beefalo. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, so it's good that we picked up some food. Uh, as long as we can keep our stats up, which we're not doing an amazing job of as of this moment, uh, we should be okay. I mean, yeah, we should be okay with this, honestly really pining for some for some survival instincts right now. Oh, thank God for this. Thank God. There's that. Come on, buddy. I need you to dry right now. Do I have a shovel? I do have a shovel. Solid. I know I shouldn't do this, but I'm going to go ahead and pick up pick these flowers up anyway. One flower is good enough. Um so our stats are decent right now. We're gonna come close to day 50 in the next episode. If we're, yeah, we'll probably end off of day 50, probably by next episode. So that's really good. Um, what am I running low on? I feel like I'm good on all stats right now. I want to see what I can make food-wise though. Um, ice box. None of this is really like super useful to me. I mean, I can make a farm. I feel like it'd be a good idea. But I, I really don't need to. I mean, I guess I can make one. I'll make one farm for now. Just so I can have more food to put in my um, crock pots. Go ahead and do that. I can get more poop anyway. Do that. 
We're really making a really just unorthodox base at this point. Uh, it's pretty pretty awkward looking base if I do say so myself. Uh, let's actually toss this on. This should break soon here. I don't have enough flowers to make another one, sadly. Let's toss this in there. We're going to go and actually pick up the monster meat that those dogs left behind in this area. Annoyingly, the beefaloes are still bumping, so we still have to deal with that. There's our seed. Boom. But yeah, this season, apparently, we are going to get attacked by uh, the... We are going to get... We're going to get attacked by the, like, weird duck thing that I saw. Uh, I don't have much experience. I don't have any experience, actually, fighting it, so it should be pretty interesting uh, seeing how we're going to have we're gonna deal with that. And I'm excited. Oh, crap, our thing broke. That sucks. As I take a sip of Gatorade, like a professional. What I really want to do, I really, really, really want to find myself the materials to get myself some clothes to be protected against the um, the friggin rain honestly hibernation vest umbrella I would love to make this but I need a deer clops eye the next time a deer clops eye is gonna be available to us is gonna be like in the day hundreds honestly so that's out of the question at this point um, floral shirt uh, summer vest Puffy vest, breezy vest, dapper vest, bush hat. Yeah, I can't really make any of this stuff, honestly. That's a little bit annoying. Our stats are decent. I mean, I could deal with freaking getting my sanity up a little bit more, but that's not available to us at this point. My chair is so freaking loud. Um, okay, let's do that just in case. We should hit day 47 here good without any problem. I'm glad we'll hit probably day 50 uh, for this series. That's really good. That's really fun. I mean, it's it's interesting to see our progression through this new DLC, or well, relatively new DLC at this point. Um, like When we started, we were not prepared at all uh, for what awaited us. So I'm glad that we've, we've advanced to the point where we're relatively comfortable. So what I say I was going to do? I remember saying that I really needed to go into over here to pick up the food that these beefaloes dropped. Um, dogs are really honestly easy if you have beefalo near you. Um, the lure plants are good but not as reliable against dogs. So I mean, if you want for sure a for sure thing against dogs, definitely try to find a base that's near the beefalo. It's always good. Seriously hoping that these beefaloes have stopped bumping. Because the beef flows are bumping at this point. Oh, are they still bumping? I can't tell. I see monster meat. Oh god, they are. They, they, oh god, they are. YOLO! Oh good god. Oh good god. Run, 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 run. Run. Oh god. Okay, we didn't take too much damage from that. That's good. I would like to get two more flowers, honestly. Two more flowers would be great for us. Oh god, more beefalo. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Where's our base? Over there? Alright then. The game isn't really tough once you've been through all of the seasons. And by that I mean, obviously, after you've been through your first set of seasons, uh, which is actually a lot, a long period of time, uh, the game just ceases to be super difficult, so I mean, I we we could end up doing something else with this series once we finish all of our seasons if we get through that long. Uh, so I mean, hopefully we do. That'd be great for us. Let's make this boom. Uh, let's pick up all of this would be good. One, two. Oh, that's a really bad idea, actually. Really bad idea. I need to get mods for this series again. Honestly, it's been a while since we've put in some new mods in this. We don't even actually have any mods in right now, which is a little bit annoying. Okay, cook. Let's put all the food back. Having an ice box is just freaking good. Honestly, I love I love having an ice box. It's so good for us. Stinking. 
Oh, is that chili? I'll use that later. I actually need to eat that now, if I'm going to be completely honest with you. I hate, hate, hate getting carrots from, from, um, from these farms. It's so annoying. I might stoop to actually make myself another farm, honestly. Chili. Sweet action. That's good. This is good. I like what's happening right now. It's annoying that this is still wet. Yeah, there's no point in putting meat on this drying rack, honestly, because it's obviously just going to continuously get wet, um, which obviously defeats the purpose of the name, drying rack. So that's a thing. Oh, and as I say that, the drying, or the rain stops. Great game. Thanks for that. I need to pick up these flowers anyway, just because of the fact that we might need to make another pretty parasol. Okay, we're doing good. What else can I kill? I would like to get more spider kills, uh, but at this point in the game, I really don't need any. Um, I'm really racking my brain. Leave in the comment section below what you think I should be making at this point. I don't feel like I can. I need to make a bunch of stuff now. I, I really don't want to put that there. That's a really bad idea. Dang, dude, we're running low on food, actually. Or, well, edible food, honestly. What do we have in our inventory here? Not much. Not much is useful for us at this point. Okay. Well, I guess in, in the next day cycle, we're probably going to work on getting another farm. That'd probably be really good for us. I might actually, actually, I might actually stoop to breaking some more of these um, glaciers. Oh, crap. I don't really need that, but you know what? That's whatever. Keep going. Keep going, keep going. I don't know, I feel like we're doing alright. We're not doing great, we're not doing bad. We're just surviving, honestly, at this point. Oh, our low sanity is a, such a depressing thing, though. We need to figure out something to make. What can we make here? Hay wall, I can do that. Stone wall, also can do that. Potted fern, scaled chest. Um, I don't know where to get scales, honestly. So that's a thing that happened. Ooh, I can make a lightning rod, right? I could, right? I can make a lightning rod. Yay, I can make a lightning rod. Like, how so you get down to that so we can actually shoot up our sanity again? I think that'd be really good for us. Lightning rod is a thing that is hap- Oh, I already had freaking stone. Dang it, that sucks. Lightning rod, where are you at? There you go. How much that shoot up us up by? Should have shot us up by a lot, actually. 89, alright, that's good. So essentially, we're building all the things now. Um, I don't really see a situation that we would be strapped for anything, really. Let's put that back in there. Let's put you in there. And we should be good. Dang. Yeah, our main problem right now is keeping our sanity up just because of these. We've had, um, we've had these really short days since pretty much the beginning of winter. So it's a little bit annoying, but you know what? It's something we have to deal with, I guess. I would love to have this guy freaking go up. Honestly, nope, nothing in there. All right then. Oh yeah, I need food big time. Big time. I need food big time. Yeah, these short days are really killing my sanity. It's making my sanity such a major thing at this point. But we should hit day 48. I'm really happy about that. We, we're we moving on in day count a lot in this series. This has been our longest series of Reign of Giants, which is great to, to realize, honestly. Um... I think our second longest series is probably in the in the 30s, so we almost have 20 more days on our high score, so that's good. Um, I mean, we've run like pretty much two. We've run two seasons, obviously, considering we're in season two. But the first series was so short that I couldn't split it into its own season, 
So I decided to combine two series of Reign of Giants into one season. So we're in season two of Reign of Giants at this point, which is good. Uh, we've gone a long ways from where we've began. Even though our base doesn't, our base, I feel like our base doesn't reflect how long we've actually survived. This isn't really a, an outstanding base, if I'm to be completely honest with you. But I mean, it is what it is. Oh, fudge. Okay, yeah, cool. I need sanity and I need food at this point. Sanity and food. Running low on food. Don't know how I'm running low on food, but I'm running low on food anyway. I can't cook this crap. Let's focus on sanity first. Hunger's a major deal, but we can always eat the monster meat, though it'll shoot down our sanity. Okay. Okay, this is bad. We actually need to run down over here and get ourselves some vault goat kills. It bothers me how those things are still like going at it. Yeah, we need to get some vault goat kills right now. This is bad. This is bad news for us if we don't get some vault goat kills. Okay. Vault goat should be along this area somewhere, if I'm not mistaken. Hopefully there's more than three. There's there's four that's really good for us. One, two, three. Crap. Okay, we needed that. Definitely. Let's get home. Let's pick up some more flowers on the way and we should be good. Okay, yeah, we need this food big time. Hopefully our, um, really hoping our, our crop is put up all the way. Uh, I mean, is like completely grown. That'd be really good for us at this point. I seriously wish we could eat those butterflies. That'd be so good for us. So good. So good. Oh, frick. Five pick up some grass too because we're going to be at a shortage of grass once we finish this and we should be good after this six cool what do we need for what are these guys four rocks we have that then let's pick up this we're pretty much going through the motions at this point autumn isn't the toughest season but it's obviously it still caught it still calls for relative Productivity. Ooh, we got a watermelon. That's awesome. We haven't gotten a watermelon yet. We don't need to put that in yet. We actually have not gotten a watermelon yet. That's exciting. Let's actually make another one of these so I don't have to pick that. Do that. Do that. So we're running a little bit low on that now. That's a little bit annoying, but whatever. Let's do that. And that, just because I can. Hopefully that'll give us meaty stew, because I really need me need meaty stew at this point. Let's go ahead and pick this up also. And we should be good. Yes, meaty stew. Thank God in heaven. How much, how low are we? Ouch. Yay! We're full up, actually. That's awesome. Meaty stew is clutch, honestly. Meaty stew is very clutch. Now the question is, do I feel like we need to make more farms? Or what can we do to get as much food as we possibly can get? These are all questions that need be answered at this point. So yeah, um, we're coming up into the ending of this episode. We're going to be hitting day 49 when this episode ends. So pretty much all, all I want you guys to do is drop in the comment section below what you guys think I should be doing for my 100 subscriber special. I'm always super interested to hear your guys' in, input on that. Uh, right after this, I'm probably going to go ahead and head into some transistor recording. Maybe something else. We'll see. It's summer, so I don't got much to do anyway. Um, and yeah. Also, oh, we also got uh, the Flying Seasock guys and I, uh, 8th and 9,000 and I, if you follow Flying Seasock at all. Um, if you know what Flying Seasock is, that'd be really cool also. Uh, we have something special for you guys 
Um, that's going to be coming out on Wednesday or Thursday, possibly. So definitely go check that out. Uh, it's going to be really fun, uh, exciting. I think you guys are going to enjoy it, all you uh, little hipster gamers out there. I actually you don't even have to be a hipster gamer to like what we're bringing out. Uh, but yeah, head over to the Flying Seesaw channel on Tuesday or Wednesday, probably Wednesday, now that I think about it, um, for something a little bit special. I don't know, we'll see. It's going to be pretty cool. It's E3 related, it's Nintendo related, so yeah, definitely guys, go head over there and check that out. That's going to be really fun, just a fun time overall. Um, and yeah, yeah, I would really like to harvest this meat that's on this freaking drying rack. Um, so yeah, that's it. Oh, okay, wow. Just the way I like it. There we go. Cool. Let's pick up some more seeds because I know we need it. Huh. Wooden flooring. I don't need any of this fancy stuff just yet. Uh, the fact that the giants are coming any day now, it just it's just rough on us, honestly. Because I don't want to make too a too good of a base. Just because the fact that I know that there's a chance, a very high chance, that a giant could just come up and just destroy it. So it's kind of a depressing thought to think about that all of this hard work that we could possibly put into this could be dashed away in a second, honestly. But enough of that morbid talk as we head into the next day cycle. We're almost at day 50, man, halfway to 100. That's exciting. That is exciting. We've been through, I want to say, two, uh, 13 episodes of Don't Starve Rain of Giants, I want to say. I don't know, 14 probably. Um, yeah, I want to say like around, oh yeah, around 14 or 15, I just checked. 14. This will be episode 15 of Rain of Giants, which is cool. So by episode 30, I'm predicting, we'll be on day 100. Which is crazy to think, honestly. This is crazy. Episode 30 of Season 2. Uh, we've had over... I want to say 74 or 75 episodes of uh, Don't Star related content go up on our channel. Which is crazy to think. Plus all of the Don't Star related stuff that I posted on Flying Seasock back in the day. That adds up to like 100 plus episodes of this freaking game I have put up. Which is crazy, honestly. That is... Whew, insane to think but yeah thank you guys so much for 100 subscribers it's really cool definitely be sharing all these videos out to your indie loving friends um, it really helps me out it helps I don't I don't want to say my dream it just helps my hobby out I guess I could say um, hashtag humble brag but oh yes hallelujah yes thank God I did not even notice that I blinked and it turned into that so good. It was super needed. But yeah, there's not much else I want to talk about. Um, heading into day 49, I know I've said that a few times. Um, we're doing good. I like the position we're in right now. Tough thing about this is the giant. Um, super nervous about that. But all these questions and more will be answered in the next episode, guys. I don't thank you guys so much for watching. As usual, my name is Tim, aka General Apit. Until next time, guys, thanks so much for watching.